hi guys welcome back to the channel today we're going to take a look at the Melrose Hill bypass now this road is currently two lanes and it's a bypass for Melrose Hill and we're on the south coast of Jamaica and Melrose Hill connects you from Poros to the town of Mandeville we're in Manchester Jamaica now Melrose Hill bypass is actually closed to traffic coming from Manchester from Mandeville to Poros because this road is now going to be a part of Highway 2000 so they are working on there you can see the highway on the right they are going to convert this road from two lanes to four lanes and it's the Melrose Hill bypass is now going to be a part of Highway 2000 now Highway 2000 Section 1C runs from Maypen to Mandeville. Highway 2000 is a project to build a highway from Kingston to Montego Bay. But it's been built in pieces and this is one piece of the highway. So let's just take a quick tour to see what kind, how far they've reached re the construction of this leg of the highway. So this is the actual highway, this is the route. As we go a little further up, you'll see the concrete barricade that are going to separate it. This is section 1C of Highway 2000, which is a highway running from Kingston to Montego Bay. And section 1C is the highway that runs from, or the section that runs from Maypen to Mandeville. So this is the May Pen to Mandeville leg of Highway 2000. This highway is 90% complete and it should open early next year. So when open, you can drive from Kingston to Mandeville on the highway. This highway is being built by China Harbor Engineering Company. They are the main contractor for all the highways in Jamaica now. So the highway is 90% complete, but this doesn't look like 90%. We have to have a lot more work done. Nonetheless, they said it should be open early next year. I think they said March 2023. So this highway is going to run from Williamsfield in Manchester all the way to the Maypen roundabout where it will merge with the existing highway because the highway from Kingston to Maypen is open, it's up and running. So this at the Maypen roundabout, more specifically at the Rio Mino bridge, that is where this section of the highway will merge with the existing section, the open section. We're not going to go much further because we don't want to interfere with the construction work that's going on and it seems like a lot of work is going on down here. So 
just giving you guys an update as to how far the project has reached.